Excuse me, sir. You can't touch our equipment. RTV6 working for you, confronting a Monrovia couple not happy to see our camera. They're accused of stealing thousands of dollars in fundraising money and spending it on themselves. Call 6 Investigates Kara Kenny reports on the fates of Donald and Michelle Paskett. Michelle and Donald Paskett of Monrovia both charged with five counts of theft and one count of corrupt business influence. According to court documents, the Paskets used a GoFundMe site to raise money for Taylor Galloway, daughter of Delbert Galloway, who was killed in a motorcycle crash. Police say the Paskets raised more than $6,000, but spent more than half of it on personal bills, car washes, baby supplies, and pizza. As part of a plea agreement, Donald Paskett pleaded guilty to one count of felony theft and was sentenced to four months home detention. The rest of the charges against Donald Paskett were dropped, and prosecutors dismissed their case against Michelle Paskett, who they say was less responsible. Kara Kenny with Channel 6. Can we ask you some questions? They dismissed the case against you. Can we ask you a few questions? Donald Paskett will have to serve 18 months probation. If he successfully completes it, the theft charge will be knocked down to a misdemeanor. Why would you take fundraising money from people that lost a loved one? Excuse me, sir. You can't touch our equipment. Did you really spend the money on bills and pizza? What do you want to say to the Galloways? Are you going to pay that money back? Deputy Prosecutor Bob Klein says this case should serve as a lesson to be careful whether you're running a fundraiser. Well, I, I give a lot of money to fundraisers myself. Or donating to one. I go to that person personally and give them money. Um, so I know, I mean, I literally hand them a check. The closer you can get to the actual person themselves, I think the better off you are. Donald Paskett has six months to pay more than $3,700 in restitution to the victim in this case, Taylor Galloway. Reporting from Morgan County, I'm Call 6 Investigates, Kara Kenny.